All right, so let's talk about what's going on today and what to do next. So you have a homework problem to finish. Um, many of you probably are already done. Um, if you need help, please ask on the forum. Um, otherwise, we have a number of events today and tomorrow that are designed to get you uh, set up properly to succeed in 125 this semester. So, you know, if you follow the instructions online, you're probably good to go. Um, but if you'd like a chance to ask some questions or talk with some other students, meet some of your classmates, we have a number of events on the calendar today, um, as well as tomorrow morning. So um, my daily walkthrough is happening at 11 a.m. Central Time. Um, I think actually, if I scroll over here the calendar, actually harsh deep. So um, he's overseas right now and he's volunteered to host some sessions for us on Eastern Time Zone. So he's actually going to be doing our first onboarding session of fall 2020 at the lovely hour of 5 a.m. I do not plan on being awake for that, uh, but some of you may be. Um, so we'll meet up. Um, I'll do my daily dose of the lesson at 11 o'clock. Uh, we'll see how that goes today. It's going to be fun. It's not lecture. It's going to be a different type of format. Um, and then throughout the afternoon, we have several different sessions. These are going to be repeated throughout the rest of the week. So don't all feel like you have to come tomorrow. If it works later in the week, it might be better for your schedule and they might be a little quieter. Um, so at two o'clock, we have our new student onboarding session and uh, Martin and Fiza are gonna lead that. I'm sure that's gonna be awesome. Um, at three o'clock, we have an Ask Us Anything session with Long Fan, who's been involved in the course staff for several semesters now and knows a lot about the class. So definitely consider attending that. Um, I'm gonna run a, a social event today at 4 p.m. So uh, you're welcome to come by, say hi, me and Nathaniel, who's awesome. Um, We'll be there just to meet you if you want to stop by. Uh, these are all on Zoom. The links are all, as you can see, on the calendar. Um, and then we actually going to run our, our first homework sessions today. Um, you know, the homework are pretty, you know, uh, straightforward for the next few days. Um, but you know, you might want to come by just to meet Lou uh, and uh, Fiza, who's awesome. Um, and then uh, Akila later at 8 p.m. Um, so those that's what's on the calendar for today. That's our programming for Monday. Uh, August 24th, day zero, first day of class. Um, and I'm excited to, to have you guys all around. So um, one thing I wanna say as, as, as just a send off today, and I'm gonna say this a lot this semester uh, because I think we all need to hear it. And I think it's something um, that's really true as part of this class is that you are not alone. Um, you're not doing this on your own. You may be by yourself, but you're not alone. You have this community of CS125 around you uh, and on the forum, through these sessions, through our interactions in this virtual world uh, that we're all inhabiting right now, um, you can you know, make connections and we're gonna try our best to, to facilitate that. But I really don't want anybody who's taking this class to feel at a loss, to feel like they're alone. Um, you're gonna get stuck, you're gonna get frustrated, you're gonna get angry, uh, you're gonna get down. This happens to me on a regular basis. And I've been doing this for 20 years and I'm good at it. So um, that's just part of you know, a life in technology. But you are not alone. You have other people around you who are going through the same thing and you have guides in terms of the course staff of people that have done this, have you know, been maybe not to the mountaintop yet, but at least farther up the hill and can help uh, cheer you on as you uh, walk some of the same paths that they walked recently. So, all right, so that's the end of today's lesson. Um, I will look forward to seeing you guys all again tomorrow where we will start to talk about variables and how computers store uh, data.